just took the oil out of this compressor. Um, it's about 700 mil, just under. But it should hold 1.36 litres, so even a layer for some of it still being in there, it's, it's seriously undercharged with oil. Um, and this, is, this should be um, ester oil. Um, so as you can see, it's quite dark. Um, that's right, there's a few bits in there as well. Good job, we've changed that. We do the one do the other one as well. Don't know if that's gonna show up. No. Some of them bits are on the bottom because it's um, the dust is stuck to it, but a lot of that is on the it's on the inside. because it's had a, a glow stick dye um, put in there at some point in the past. You can see it's a lot cleaner than the other one. This is, this is actually mineral oil. Um, most of that colour I think is a dye. So that shows how dirty the other one was. That's the wires on, onto the um, on the terminals and the compressor, they, they obviously when they've changed the compressors in the past, it's probably gone from a screw terminal to these push on crimp ones, and uh, they've crimped this and uh, left that wire uh, exposed like that. Well, left it, you know, left it like that, just could have, could have cut it back here and crimped it again. Um, but they've left that like that with a bit of um, insulating tape on there that's fallen off. The, the one on the other unit, they, they hadn't quite crimped, pushed the wire in enough when they crimped it. And there's a bit of copper showing there, and a bit of tape around that one as well. So we'll, we'll sort this out before we put the temples back on here. Yeah. 